How do you show your sister you love her on her special day? We're going to talk about that on this episode of 5 Minutes with Dad. Welcome to 5 Minutes with Dad, starring Pavlos and Angela Pavlidis, where you get to spend a few minutes with the smartest and coolest kids in the whole world, and they're dead, too. And now, here are your hosts, Pavlos, Angela, and Nick Pavlidis. Who's ready for an awesome for another, episode hey. of 5 Minutes with Dad? Hey, what am okay, I? What am I? An old piece of birthday cake? No. No? What am I? I'm excited. That's what I am. Mm -hmm. We have a very, 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 very special day today. Why? Because we're celebrating Ange and welcoming back to the microphone, the one, the only... Pavlos Pavlidis! Welcome to the mic! That's right, folks. Mind blown. Pavlos, welcome back to Five Hi. Minutes with Dad! Hi. Yeah, Pavlos, well, so here's what's been going on in the Pavlidis household. Angela has been so excited about the podcast that we've been recording so many episodes with her. And Pavlos has just been chilling, not avoiding the podcast, but just not doing podcast episodes. So he's just been chilling and Ange and I get behind the mic. But we typically don't record anymore with both kids because we they tend to want to be pressing buttons together and it gets to be a lot of work. Hey, that's my answer. <laughs> so, Pavlos, welcome back. Are you excited to be back? Mm -hmm. Yeah, everyone missed you. Everyone was asking, where's Pavlos? And I said, it's not that Pavlos is going away. It's that Ange is taking over. Ange took over your podcast for like two months. Okay. Pretty cool, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And that's awesome. That's such good teamwork that when Ange wants to do it, Pavlos chillaxes. And sometimes we'll just record more. And you know what? If Pavlos and I record 10 episodes and Ange and I record 10 episodes. Maybe we'll put out some bonus episodes. How about that? Sounds good? Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. So today we have a special episode because it is a very, very special day in our household. And that is, let's see what day this is going to drop. This is going to drop. This is going to go live the day after. Angela's birthday. So we are celebrating Angela's birthday. And this is actually a surprise podcast episode for Angela because she has no idea we're recording this right now. Right, buddy? Mm -hmm. Yep. So we're recording a surprise birthday episode for Angela and showing her we love her. So how do we do that? We're going to say birthday jokes of the week. We have a birthday resource of the week, which is something that Angela's getting from Yaya for her birthday. So she knows it by now. So she's going to, when she hears this, she knows. So we can't ruin the surprise. And uh, we're going to share, Pavlis is going to share two things he loves about his sister. And I'm going to share two things I love about his sister. And we are going to celebrate Angela. Uh, how does that sound, Pavlos? Good. All right. So, Pavlos, do you want to say the first joke of the week or the knock-knock joke? The joke. All right. So, now it's time for the joke what of the you, week. What do you say to a rabbit on its birthday? What do you say to a rabbit on its birthday? I don't know. Happy what do you say? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Pavlos wants the laughs. I like it. Yes. You say... You can have this one. <laughs> okay, here comes mine. Pavlos will be the judge of my joke of the week. My knock-knock joke, okay? Ready? Here we go. Knock-knock. Who's there? Abby. Abby who? Abby birthday to you. Hey! <laughs> All right, we'll take... Oh, we got, I, heard one, I heard one laugh in the back. <laughs> we get both? All right. So there we go for the joke of the week. All right. So now we're going to get into the resource of the week. And one thing that's super important when we're talking about any birthdays or really just talking about anything when we're giving a gift or saying something nice to someone is that it's personalized. It, to it goes to what they like. So that's why Yaya got Angela an air track gymnastics tumbling mat that is inflatable and comes with a mat. 
It is a home. Instead of inflatable, incredible. <laughs> Follow, follows freestyling with the jokes now. I like it. And uh, so it's pretty cool. It is. It, we saw it. It has really cool ratings. And Angela loves flip flopping all around the yard. Sometimes I feel like she's just cartwheeling all around the neighborhood. She just, hey, can we go outside? And I, we go outside. Next thing you know, her feet are straight up in the air. I say, my goodness, Ange, you love gymnastics. And it's super important. When we know we like something, then we can enjoy it more and more as we grow. So if you like gymnastics and want to get a home gymnastics uh, mat, you can go to Amazon. Just go to five minutes with dad.com slash Matt M A T. And that'll get you the exact air track tumbling mat that Angela got for her ninth birthday. I can't believe Angela's nine years old today or yesterday when this drops, she's nine years old. When she started this podcast, she was two years old. We started recording when she was two and a half and the episodes went live when she was two years and nine or 10 months. And Pavlos had just turned four. He was recording since he was three. And now Pavlos, tell everyone how old you are. 11. All right, Pavlos, we need you to, t- to turn down the energy a little bit. You're going to hurt everyone's ears. 11. <laughs> Pavlos is 11 years old. Can anyone on the other side of these this podcast who's listening right now, can you tell how excited I am to have Pavlos back behind the mic with me today? My goodness, I love having Pavlos behind the mic. So Angela was two years old. Now she's nine years old. A few years ago, I, I said to Pavlos and Angela, my goodness, you guys have been podcasting half your life. Now you've been podcasting practically all your life. How crazy is that, buddy? Really? Yeah. Do you like it? Do you have fun? What's your favorite thing about your podcast? Don't know. Don't know? You just, just like doing it or do you like... Just like doing it. You got to talk in the mic. People can't hear you. I just like doing it. Nice. Awesome. Well, I like doing it too. My favorite part is recording, but also every once in a while we see something uh, where the where the podcast is ranked as a top podcast for kids. And usually, I don't really say, it, it happens quite a bit, which is awesome. But usually, I don't say anything on the show just because we record and it, and it just doesn't come up. But one of them I wanted to mention just because it just came out a couple weeks ago. And it is, it's 15 entertaining and educational podcasts for your child. And it's on First Cry's website, First Cry Parenting. And what's really cool about it is that on its list is, uh, like many of the lists, is a whole bunch of podcasts by big companies and stuff like that, which is really, really cool. But also, Five Minutes with Dad, the podcast that Pavlos thought of when he was three years old. And now, just the things that they say about our podcast really, really warm my heart. So, Pavlos, this one came out. August 25th. So just, if this is dropping September 7th. So just two weeks ago. And it says, number seven, five minutes with dad. Looking for short podcasts that cover parenting with your kids? Maybe you're a single mom with kids who doesn't have a father figure? This podcast is made for you. It features a dad teaching kids lessons about kindness, patience, gratitude, and how to do the stuff they want or always wanted to learn. Basically, life lessons taught by a dad. Now, when I read that, my heart started really, really singing just to know that we have the opportunity to share fun, simple stuff you see with a people. Magic trick? You want to see a magic trick? Yes. Oh, Pavlos is going to push a button. Make my mic go back. And hey. now he can't talk and I can only. Hey, <laughs> they might be able to hear me in your mic. <laughs> hey, all right. Now I'm back. I hope you could still hear me in Pavlos's mic. Pavlos found the mute button on our, <laughs> on our podcast thing. You like that, buddy? Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. So let's get in. So thank you to First Cry. <laughs> thank you to First Cry and the author of the article, which uh, Rochelle Fernandez. Thank you so much. It's such an honor to be able to share just simple conversations with everyone and have some fun. And I got to tell you, 
If not a single person listened to this podcast, I would have so much fun just spending time with Pavlos and Angela, but it warms my heart to know that people listen and that it adds value to your life. So thank you everybody for rating, reviewing, sharing us on social media, and to those who feature us, uh, we want to start giving you all shout outs. So thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So Pavlos, let's get in to Hey, <laughs> <laughs> I'm using him again. <laughs> All right. So let's get in to the <laughs> see Pavlos. You missed this. You missed the podcast, didn't you? Having fun like this, <laughs> muting your dad. <laughs> Don't you wish sometimes you had a mute button in real life for your dad? No. No. Oh, you like when I talk? Yeah. All right. I love you, buddy. All right. So let's start talking about happy birthday to Angela. So I'm going to sing happy birthday day to you happy birthday to you happy birthday to and happy birthday to Pablo. <laughs> hey you muted me just to give himself a birthday message happy birthday to angela happy birthday to you now why don't i start Pablo looks like he's giggling himself so he can't even talk <laughs> So we're going to each share two things that are so special about She's Angela. Funny. <laughs> All right. Pavlos. Oh, Pavlos is back. Pavlos can breathe again. <laughs> so nothing like, <laughs> so I found Pavlos's joke muting me funny, but I didn't find them as funny as Pavlos found his joke <laughs> funny. <laughs> I love you, buddy. Awesome. All right. So. Pavlos, let's share two things. First of all, give us a big happy birthday to Ange. Happy birthday, Pablos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your sister is a, is the type of person who would laugh at that because she'd say, oh, Pablos. <laughs> but, all right, so, t- Pablos, tell us two things that you love that make Angela so special. That she's nice. That she's and nice. Funny. That she's nice and funny. Talk into the front of the mic. I think you might. That might... she's nice and funny. Yes, there we go. That'll help. So, yes, she is nice and funny. So, I, um, so let's talk about nice. One of the things that I notice about Ange, that she is nice. Always sharing. Yeah, she is always sharing. She shares. And sometimes she says funny stuff, like <laughs> when I do in the podcast. <laughs> yes. Yes. You both have such awesome personalities. Do you know in high school, um, do you remember the year you, did you have a yearbook this year? I thought you did at, at your school, at elementary Don't school. Know. Um, talking to the front. Don't know. Um, so here, let's move the mic so you can talk into it easier. Don't know. Don't know. Yeah, I think you did. But in high school, there's a yearbook. And that's like a book that they print out with everyone's picture in it. And with um, and they vote for people. Or they used to when I was in high school. And one of the, at the end, they call those superlatives. So they say like, most likely to succeed, best hair, things like that. And I know you might find it hard to believe, but I won best hair when I was in high school. Sure. <laughs> I know. Now I'll win least hair. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> but one of the other things that I won was best personality. And you and Angela, my goodness, you guys have the best personalities around. You're fun. You're funny. You're kind. You're just all sorts of awesome. You're like nine pounds of awesome in a five pound barrel. Overflowing with awesome. <laughs> Anyhow, so yeah, Angela, it's oh, Pablo's didn't like that. <laughs> yeah, you're the Mine best, buddy. The funny ones, but yes. Um, so, so yes, yeah, she's she shares really well, and she's funny. She says funny stuff. She's goofy sometimes. She likes to sing. She likes to dance. Right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So the two things that I want to say about Angela about Pavlos. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. Here we go. So this is what I'm going to say apparently about Pavlos. He's such a young lady, such an hey, awesome young lady. I'm not Angela. <laughs> oh, you, were, you weren't talking into the front of the mic. I'm not Angela. <laughs> so I knew that would get him. Um, so yes, so she's turned into. Hey, none of those are written down. <laughs> yeah, I didn't write down the young lady thing on the note, but once you once you muted me, I said I got to fight fire <laughs> with fire. <laughs> so so Angela is such a caring young lady. She is so she likes crafts. She likes doing her hair. She likes making jewelry. She just knows what she likes, and she is pursuing it in everything she does. And it's so inspiring. I love seeing people doing what they love and just being themselves. So 
I love that. She's creative and she's such an awesome young lady. And then the other thing about Angela is that she is so caring. She loves spending time with people. Whenever I'm sitting down on the couch, if I'm sitting down on the couch for more than five minutes and Angela hasn't crawled up on the couch next to me, I start to worry because she just loves spending time with me. And I love spending time with her. And she's like that with everybody. She likes getting toys. She likes getting presents. But my goodness, Angela would be happy, happy, happy if she just got time with her brother, time with her mom, time with me. And I just love that because I love spending time with her too. So all together, you got a funny, nice, caring pavlos creative young lady named no <laughs> creative young man named pavlos <laughs> nothing about the lady <laughs> well all right so we had this special episode about angela so happy birthday angela your first nine years spinning around the sun have been some of the best years of my life you and pavlos make me so happy and excited and proud i am so honored to be sharing the microphone with you and when you hear this we're not going to tell Ange, Pavlos that this episode is going to air. She's going to think one of her episodes is going to air. And when she listens to it, she's going to be so surprised. So what do you say to Anne? Surprise! Surprise, Pavlos! <laughs> Happy birthday! Hi, future Pavlos! Future Pavlos! Happy birthday! All right. So, Pavlos... Don't forget, everybody, pick up that mat if you want to do gymnastics like Ange with 5minutesWithDad.com slash mat. Happy birthday. Listen to 5 Minutes with Dad. To connect with Pavlos, Angela, and Nick, subscribe to the 5 Minutes with Dad newsletter at 5minuteswithdad.com.